게임을 다시 시작합니다. 이거 웃기 새끼네 이거 진짜. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. 아 내가 지금 빡쳐 가지고 그게 버그가 맞는지 다시 한번 확인을 만약 똑같은 거면 내가 왼쪽으로 갔어요. When Stanley came to a set of two open. This was not the correct way to the meeting room and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first just to admire it. Wow. 이렇게 와서 yes. This room. But 정론을 아니까. Back to business. Stanley took the first open door on his left. 여기서 왼쪽으로 아니야 다 반대로 했지 내가 반대로. Stanley was so bad at following directions. It's incredible. 전부 다 반대로. Look, Stanley. I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really. I'm not. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else. 전화를 한번 안 받아보겠어요. 전화를. The fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. 어 저기도 길이 있네. Someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. Someone you've forgotten. 아니야 전화를 한번 안 받아볼래. Stop trying to make every decision by yourself. Now I'm not asking for me. I'm asking. 여기서 그녀가 있다고 나한테 낚았단 말이야. This is it, Stanley. Your chance to redeem yourself. To put your work aside, to let her back into your life, she's been waiting. Was 전화 올리지? That's her, Stanley. You need to be the. Oh no 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 no! You can't. Did you just unplug the phone? Oh, 전화 코드 뽑아버렸어요. That wasn't supposed to be a choice. How did you do that? You actually chose incorrectly. I didn't even know that was possible. Let me double check. 무슨 뭐 대사 확인하고 있는 거야 대본? It's definitely here, clear as day. Stanley picks up the phone. He's taken to his apartment where he finds his wife, and the two pledge themselves to one another. Music comes in, fade to white. 지가 원하는 대로 안 됐어 지금. Not picking up the phone is actually somehow an incorrect course of action. How is that even possible? None of these decisions were supposed to mean anything. I don't understand. How on earth are you making meaningful choices? What did you? Wait a second. Did I just see? No, that's not possible. I can't believe it. How had I not noticed it sooner? You're not Stanley. You're a real person. Never Stanley, I mean. I can't believe I was so mistaken. This is why you've been able to make correct and incorrect choices, and to think I've been letting you run around in this game for so long. If you've made any more wrong choices, you might have negated it entirely. It's as though you completely ignored even the most basic safety protocol for real-world decision making. Or did you not grasp the severity of the situation? Well, I won't have that kind of risk on my watch. I'm going to stop the game for a moment so we can educate you properly on safe decision making in the real world. Please observe this helpful instructional video. Well, choice. It's the best part of being a real person, but if used incorrectly, can also be the most dangerous. For example, in this scenario, a hypothetical real person named Stephen has a choice. He could spend years helping improve the quality of life for citizens. 아니, 근데 담배를 왜 붙여줘? 담배 불을. 저건 나쁜 선택이라는 건가? Set fire to every orphan living in a 30-kilometer radius of his house. 저건 뭐야? Which choice would you make? Remember that unlike here, the real world makes sense, and at no time should you make a choice that does not conform to rational logic. If you find yourself speaking with a person who does not make sense, in all likelihood, that person is not real. Allow the person to finish their thought, then provide an excuse why you cannot continue talking. Turn to a partner and practice saying, "My goodness, is it 4:30? I'm supposed to be having a back sack and crack." 그래서 연습? Excellent. Making choices on a regular basis is the best part to a healthy decision-making process. Most medical professionals recommend making at least eight choices per day. Do you make more than eight? Less? And finally, if you begin to wonder if your choices are actually meaningful and whether you'll ever make a significant contribution to the world, just remember that in the vast infiniteness of space, your thoughts and problems are materially <laughs> insignificant, <laughs> and the feeling should subside. At this time, your instructor will guide you in an exercise to test and reinforce the material covered in this video. Ah, 
Ah, well. welcome back. You may have noticed that this room has begun to deteriorate as a result of narrative contradiction. But not to worry. Now that you're properly informed on good decision-making, we're going to revisit a choice you made just a few minutes ago and see what the correct thing to do would have been. 날 세뇌를 했으니 way, 이제 똑바로 선택하란 얘긴가? 어... 아니야 이 새끼 말안 들을 거야. 나 계속 연맥였어요. 이거 지금 여기는 이걸 타는 길밖에 없는 것 같은데. Now that we know your choices are meaningful, we can't have you jumping off the platform and dying. 와, 나못 뛰어내리게. Dying senselessly halfway through the storm. 난간을 만들었네. Story would make no sense at all. We just need to get you home as soon as possible before the narrative contradiction gets any worse. Unfortunately, 절로 갈까 봐. 이걸 만들어 버렸어. 정해진 대로만 가게. 나쁜 새끼. 거봐, 내가 가는 데만 열리지. 일직선, 일직선 진행만 가능하게 얘가 좀 바꾼 것 같은데. 어, 한 곳만 갈수 있게 스토리를 아예 바꿔버린 것 같아, 이 자식이. Almost there. You'll take the door on the left, back to the correct ending. The story will have resolution once again, and you'll be home free in the real world. 왼쪽 문이라는 게 아까 처음에 오른쪽 왼쪽 고를 때그 왼쪽 문 말하는 건가? 어. 그렇지 여기 왼쪽 문이지. Now remember, all you need to do is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. 그러니까 되돌린 거야 지금. 테이블 다시 감아서. When he came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. 개새끼야. No. I didn't do that. Quickly, hurry back in the other direction. Perhaps we're not too late. 아문 열어줘. 아이씨. 아이씨 여기 이렇게 물, 문 막아놨네 아이씨 아니야 역시 삐대봐 삐대봐 이 새끼 열어줄지도 몰라 삐대 삐대 문 열어 빨리 열어 아 안되네 결국은 선택지를 하나밖에 없게 만들었어. 안 열리고. 안 열리고. 안 열리고. 안 열리고. 여기 회의실이지? 어, 회의실 망가졌네? I can't believe after everything we talked about that you my story you've destroyed my work. Why? For what? What did you get out of that? What did you think was so special about seeing the game undone, left here like so much garbage? It, well, it's worthless now. And what am I supposed to do? Even if there were a way to continue, would it be worth it? Game Tiger. To know that my story is now incorrect? How can I go back to that? I can't erase that knowledge. I'll have to live with it forever. Reliving it and possibility forever. I couldn't live that way. Is it better to shut the game down entirely? To willingly destroy all of my work? I don't know. What's the answer? What do I do? What do I do? What do I? No, I have to. 내가 이긴 거야. I have to shut the game down. I have to. I have to. 게임 종 게임을 종료하라고? 뭐야? 게임이 알고리즘이 부서졌나봐. 
What, did you think that would be funny? You just had to see? Didn't I impress upon you how important it was to be like Stanley? He actually knows how to do what I tell him to. He understands that if I say to do something, there's a damn good reason for it. That thought hadn't even occurred to you, had it? That there's a world outside of you. Oh. You're a child. Oh, my story. If you'd just gone through the door on the left, you would have seen it. There was a whole underground facility. You would have destroyed it and been victorious. It would have been so perfect. I worked so hard on it. I tried so hard. Oh well. Is behave exactly as Stanley. <laughs> that means choosing responsibly and always putting the story. How about the key to doing Gonya, Nante? Just follow my lead, and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. No! Why did you do that? Quickly! His behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and the first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <clears throat> No! Why did you do that? Quickly! Hurry! Is behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just Alright. I come on you so when Stanley came to a set of two open doors. He entered the door. 지금 지금 내가 지금 컴퓨터하고 머리 사 머리 싸움하는 거야 지금. 아예 아무 쪽으로도 안 가는 거야. 움직이지도 말고. 이 새끼 뭐라고 할까? 나 존나 궁금해. <웃음> 음. 뒤로는 안 뒤로는 안 가지나? 한 번만 더 가보자 한 번만. No, why did you do that? Quickly, hurry. 이거는 계속 리셋인 것 같아. 이거는 똑같이. Exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. <웃음> When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. 잠깐만. 그래 리셋이 점점 빨라지는 것 같은데? No 하면서 바로. No. Why did you do that? Quickly, hurry. 이거 봐, 더 빨라져. 말도 다 끝나기 전에. Just behave exactly as Stanley would. That means choosing responsibly and always putting the story first. I'm quite sure you'll be up to the task. Just follow my lead and you'll be fine. All right. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. 들어갔다가 바로 나와봐. 가기 전에 바로 나와. 약올리기, 약올리기 잼. 여기 그냥 무한 반복인 것 같아 그래 예, 하라는 대로 한번 해보자. 안 열리고 안 열리고 안 열리고 또 여기. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. 안 열리고 사장실 가려면 올라가라 그랬는데 어? 아까는 내려가는 길이 있었는데 어내 기억에 의하면은 올라가는 길이 있고 내려가는 길이 있었는데 지금 길을 막아버렸네 와이 새끼 봐라 이거 알고리즘을 바꿨어 얘가 어 점프는 없어요. 점프는 없고. 그러면은 첫 번째 그거랑 어 사장실이 바뀌었어. 
아까랑 틀려. 이런 이렇게 안 생겼었는데. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief who orchestrated this until he saw the door with a voice receiver next to it. So in the I am the most expensive boss. The answers to his questions, and beyond all probability, he knew the passcode. He had seen it on his boss's computer just last week. Night Shark one one five. Was this the code to open the door? Would it still work? There was only one way to find out. Stanley had been trained never to speak up. But now he would draw from within himself the courage to face the unknown. He drew a sharp breath, and then spoke the code. 말을 말하지 말아 보자. 여기다 대고 말하면 얘가 하라는 대로 하는 거잖아. 딴데 나가는 길 없나? 아니 이 새끼가 하라는 대로 하면은. Stanley spoke the code. Night Shark one one five. 안해 임마 안해 안할 거야. Right there on the wall. Ah, 지가 빡쳐서 그냥 여는 거 아니야? 안 해도? I'm sorry. Is there a problem? You didn't mishear me, did you? Ah, 지가 그냥 열거 같은데? Please speak the code into the receiver. Otherwise, we can't get on with the story. This is a crucial step. 안 해, 안 해, 안 해. 배째, 배째, 씨 등따. Okay, fine. You're not gonna do it. 안 해, 안 해, 안 해. It's pretty humiliating to bring you this far, only for you to suddenly decide you have better things to do. I asked you for this one single thing for your respect, the kind of respect Stanley shows for his choices. He knows what it means to take a story seriously. If you didn't want to see what I had to show you, then why did you come here? You had a choice, you know. You could have gone through the door. Wow, exactly. What are you going to do? Whatever the hell you wanted over there. Why did you come this way? Speak. Say something to me. Explain yourself. Oh, you're making me want to. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he oh, what is this? This is the one that was there earlier. Hello. Are you? Is everything okay? Stanley, please. I I need you to make a choice. I need you to walk through the door. The end? The end? Are you listening to me? Can you hear me? Is everything all right? Stanley, this is important. You boy. The story needs you. It needs you to make a decision. It cannot exist. Ah, 이게 진행돼요? You understand me? Whatever choice you make is just fine. They're both correct. You cannot be wrong here. We can work together. I'll accept whatever you do. I simply need you to take that step forward, please. Choose. 내가 지금 나한테 얘기를 하고 있는 건가? Anything. This is more important than you can ever know. I need this. The story needs it. 만약에 내가 여기로 가면. So, you hear me? Are you there? Are you listening to this, Danny? Are you there? Okay. It's okay. I can wait. You need time to decide. Time to make sure your choice is correct. That is the best choice. That's all right. 하긴 저걸 움직일 캐릭터가 없으니 저게 움직일 수가 없지. Take as much time as you need. 뭐야 또? 아 이거 뭐야 또 여기야 이거 엔딩이라매. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? 아니 엔딩이라매. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed the memo. 엔딩이 몇 개인데? 엔딩이 어 많다고? 그래. 아 여기 또 왔어. 아. 여기 또 왔어. 씨. 어우 그래 여기서 한번 한번 들어주고 한번 안 들어주고 한번 들어주고 한번 안 들어주고 해보자 한번 들어주고 한번 안 들어주고 한번 들어주고 한번 안 들어주고 여기서 내려가는 길이 있거든? 화장실 그래 여기 아까는 내려가는 길이 없었잖아 내려갈 거야 임마. 난 내려갈 거야. 이거 어둡지? 
But Stanley just couldn't do it. 없었습니다. 어 이것도 그럼 있었던 얘기야. Admitting he had left his post during work hours, he might be fired for that. And in such a competitive economy, why had he taken that risk? All because he believed everyone had vanished. His boss would think he was crazy. And then something occurred to Stanley. Maybe, he thought to himself, maybe I am crazy. All of my co-workers blinking mysteriously out of existence in a single moment for no reason at all. None of it made any logical sense. And as Stanley pondered this, he began to make other strange observations. For example, why couldn't he see his feet when he looked down? Why did doors close automatically oh, behind him wherever he went? went? And for that matter, these rooms were starting to look pretty familiar. Were they simply repeating? No, Stanley said to himself, this is all too strange. This can't be real. And at last, he came to the conclusion well. that had been on the tip of his tongue. He oh. just hadn't found the words for it. I'm dreaming, he yelled. This is all a dream. Oh, what a relief Stanley felt to have finally found an answer, an explanation. His co-workers weren't actually wrong. He wasn't going to lose his job. He wasn't crazy after all. And he thought to himself, I suppose I'll wake up soon. I'll have to go back to my boring real-life job pushing buttons. I may as well enjoy this while I'm still losing. Wow, he's still the same. He imagined himself flying and began to gently float above the ground. Na 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 yo. Soaring through space on a magical star field, and it too appeared. It was so much fun, and Stanley marvelled that he had still not woken up. How was he remaining so lucid? And then perhaps the strangest question of them all entered Stanley's head. Why was he so amazed he hadn't asked himself sooner? Why is there a voice in my head dictating everything that I'm doing and thinking? Now the voice was describing itself, being considered by Stanley, who found it particularly strange. I'm dreaming about a voice describing me, thinking about how it's describing my thoughts. 목소리가 내 생각을 묘사하고 있는 것에 대한 생각하고 있는 것을 당신이 고아 복잡해. If this voice spoke to all people in their dreams, the truth was that, of course, this was not a dream. How could it be? Was Stanley simply deceiving himself, believing that if he's asleep, he doesn't have to take responsibility for himself? Stanley is as awake right now as he's ever been in his life. Now, hearing the voice speak these words was quite a shock to Stanley. After all, he knew for certain that this was in fact a dream. Did the voice not see him float and make the magical stars just a moment ago? How else would the voice explain all that? This voice was a part of himself too. Surely, surely, if he could just... He would prove it. He would prove that he was in control. That this was a dream. So he closed his eyes gently, and he invited himself to wake up. He felt the cool weight of the blanket on his skin. Coming or was hurting on his back. The mattress on his back. The fresh air of a world outside this one. Let me wake up, he thought to himself. I'm through with this dream. I wish it to be over. Let me go back to my job. Let me continue pushing the buttons. Please, it's all I want. I want my apartment, and my wife, and my job. All I want is my life exactly the way it's always been. My life is normal. I am normal. Everything will be fine. I am okay. 나 지금 재울려고 그러는 거니 얘? 뭐야? 눈을 떴는데 똑같아. 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 시발 똑같아. I have a boss. I have an office. I am real. Please, just someone tell me I am real. I must be real. I must be. Can anyone hear my voice? Who am I? Who am I? And everything went black. 뭐야 얘? This is the story of a woman named Mariella. Mariella? Mariella woke up on a day like any other. She arose, got dressed, gathered her belongings, and walked to her place of work. <laughs> on this particular day, her walk was interrupted by the body of a man who had stumbled through town talking and screaming to himself, and then collapsed dead on the sidewalk. <clears throat> and although she would soon turn to go call for an ambulance, 
For just a few brief moments, she considered the strange man. He was obviously crazy, this much she knew. Everyone knows what crazy people look like. And in that moment, she thought to herself how lucky she was to be normal. I am sane. I am in control of my mind. I know what is real and what isn't. It was comforting to think this, and in a certain way, seeing this man made her feel better. But then she remembered the meeting she had scheduled for that day, the very important people whose impressions of her would affect her career, and by extension, the rest of her life. She had no time for this, so it was only a moment that she stood there, staring down at the body. And then she turned and ran. What? This is the Ah! <sighs> <sighs>